Have you ever wondered why FedEx, a global courier delivery service company, would need missile defense systems on its airplanes? Yes, you heard it right. Missile defense systems, those high-tech military-grade protections usually associated with fighter jets and warships. It certainly seems like a curious addition to a fleet of commercial aircrafts tasked with delivering packages across the globe, doesn't it? But before we delve into the reasons behind this unusual security measure, let's take a brief detour to understand what missile defense systems are. In simple terms, these are mechanisms designed to detect and destroy incoming missiles before they can cause any harm. Their typical uses? Well, you'll usually find them in military settings, providing a shield against potential threats. So, why would FedEx, a civilian company, need such a system? It's a question that begs an answer. Stay tuned as we dive deep into the answers to this compelling question. To understand why FedEx uses missile defense systems, we first need to understand the company and its operations. FedEx is a global courier delivery services company headquartered in Memphis, Tennessee. It's one of the world's largest express transportation companies, delivering millions of packages and freight to over 220 countries every single day. That's right, every single day. FedEx's global operations are akin to a well-oiled machine. The company operates a vast network of over 650 aircraft, including some of the world's largest cargo airplanes. This impressive fleet embarks on thousands of flights daily, touching down in hundreds of airports across the globe. With such an extensive network, the sun never truly sets on FedEx's operations. But with such vast operations and a constant presence in the skies, comes a unique set of risks. FedEx's aircraft operate in all kinds of weather conditions, across diverse terrains and in various geopolitical landscapes. This exposes the company's fleet to potential threats, both natural and man-made. Just like any other airline, FedEx must deal with the risks of mechanical issues, severe weather, and pilot error. But, given the global nature of its operations, FedEx also faces an additional set of challenges. These include potential threats to its aircraft, ranging from bird strikes to more sinister risks like missile attacks. While the odds of such events are incredibly low, the potential impact is devastating. A single incident could not only result in the loss of lives and valuable cargo, but also damage the company's reputation and shake the trust of millions of customers worldwide. Therefore, FedEx has to be proactive and take every possible measure to mitigate these risks. This involves rigorous maintenance schedules, stringent safety measures, and yes, even equipping its aircraft with missile defense systems. With such a massive scale of operations, ensuring the security of every flight becomes of utmost importance. After all, in the world of FedEx, the safety of their crew, cargo and aircraft is not just a priority, it's an absolute necessity. The world is not always a safe place and FedEx's planes are not immune to threats. In an ideal world, every aircraft would glide through the skies without a care but unfortunately, we live in reality. Commercial airplanes including those operated by FedEx face a variety of threats. These threats range from technical malfunctions to extreme weather conditions. But one of the most harrowing dangers comes from the ground, missile attacks. Now you might be thinking, missile attacks? That sounds like something out of a movie. But it's not as far-fetched as it sounds. In fact, there have been several incidents in the past where commercial planes have been targeted. Take for instance the tragic incident involving Malaysia Airlines Flight 17. In July of 2014 the plane was shot down over Ukraine, killing all 298 people on board. Investigators later confirmed that the plane was brought down by a missile launched from a territory held by pro-Russian separatists. Similarly, in January of 2020, Ukraine International Airlines Flight 752 was shot down shortly after takeoff from Tehran's Imam Khomeini International Airport. All 176 passengers and crew were killed. Iranian authorities later admitted that the plane was mistakenly targeted by its own missile defense system. These incidents may not be frequent, but they do happen. And they serve as a stark reminder of the dangers that commercial airplanes, including FedEx's fleet, can face. It's a sobering realization that the skies are not always friendly, and that the threats are not always visible. When these threats escalate into reality, the consequences are devastating. Lives are lost, families are shattered, and companies like FedEx, whose operations are heavily reliant on aviation, can face significant setbacks. These threats are not just figments of our imagination, they are real, and they could have devastating consequences. 
The need for protective measures like missile defense systems on commercial airplanes is not just a luxury, but a necessity in our increasingly volatile world. These threats are real and could have devastating consequences. So what exactly are these missile defense systems and how do they work? Great question. At the most basic level, missile defense systems are designed to intercept and destroy incoming missiles. They do this through a combination of radar detection, tracking systems, and interceptor missiles. First off, radar systems are used to detect the presence of an incoming missile. These radar systems are incredibly sophisticated, capable of detecting objects hundreds of miles away and distinguishing between different types of threats. Once a threat is detected, the system immediately moves into tracking mode, following the path of the incoming missile and calculating where it is likely to hit. The next step is where things get really exciting. The defense system launches its own interceptor missile. This isn't your average missile though. These interceptors are specially designed to destroy the incoming missile in mid-flight, either by direct impact or by releasing a blast of fragments. The result is a spectacular mid-air explosion that neutralizes the threat before it can reach its target. Now you might be wondering what kind of missile defense systems could FedEx possibly use on its planes? Well, one possibility is a system known as DRCM or Directed Infrared Countermeasures. This technology utilizes infrared lasers to confuse and divert heat-seeking missiles. It's essentially a high-tech decoy system. When a missile is detected, the DIRCM system fires a laser at the missile, confusing its heat-seeking technology and causing it to veer off course. Another option is the use of flare or chaff dispensers. These systems release small pieces of reflective material or bright flares to distract the incoming missile. The missile, fooled by the bright lights or reflective material will hopefully change its course and miss the plane entirely. Whatever the system FedEx uses, the goal is the same. To protect their planes, cargo and crew from potential threats. These systems are designed to detect and neutralize threats, ensuring the safe journey of FedEx's cargo and crew. Now that we know the threats and the defense, let's understand why FedEx decided to take this step. FedEx is a company that operates on a global scale, delivering packages to individuals and businesses all over the world. Their operations are vast and complex, and as such, the safety and integrity of these operations are of utmost importance. In an era where threats are constantly evolving and risks are ever-present, FedEx recognized the need to take measures to protect their operations against potential missile attacks. The decision to implement missile defense systems on their airplanes was not made lightly. It was a strategic move, driven by the desire to ensure the safety of their staff, their operations, and the packages they are entrusted with. FedEx understood that the cost of not taking action could potentially be far greater than the cost of installing these systems. By choosing to invest in missile defense systems, FedEx is sending a clear message. Safety is their top priority. They are willing to bear the costs, navigate the complexities, and face the challenges involved in installing these systems because they believe it is a necessary step to protect their operations. This decision also reflects FedEx's commitment to their customers. They understand that their customers entrust them with their packages, and they take this responsibility seriously. For FedEx, ensuring that these packages reach their destination safely is not just about fulfilling a service, it's about living up to the trust placed in them by millions of customers worldwide. So, while the decision to implement missile defense systems may have been a costly one, it was a decision that FedEx felt was necessary. They understood the risks, they understood the threats, and they chose to take action. They chose to prioritize safety, even if it meant incurring additional costs. For FedEx, no cost is too high when it comes to protecting their operations, their staff, and their customers' packages. Let's summarize what we've discussed today. In a world increasingly connected, FedEx plays a pivotal role, with its immense global operations reaching every corner of the globe. But this worldwide reach isn't without risks. The threats are real and varied, from natural disasters to human-made perils. That's where missile defense systems come into the picture. These advanced technologies are not just for military use anymore. They provide a shield, an extra layer of protection for these airborne delivery fortresses, FedEx didn't just wake up one day and decide to equip its fleet with missile defense systems, it was a calculated decision, a strategic move to ensure the safety of their aircraft, crew, and the millions of packages they carry daily. So the next time you see a FedEx plane in the sky, remember, it's more than just a package carrier. It's a fortress flying high.